Hi guys. What's up? You're watching Interesting and Figures. Today there will be a mega cool project at 24 hour survival challenge. We will try not only to spend the night in the forest, but we'll also test our ability to build a shelter in the forest. The main idea is that we got two basic tool sets. There is a knife, scissors, saw, and etc. And there is a material with which you can build a shelter. There we have a plastic film and here is a lot of scotch tape. Now with the help of RPS we'll determine who will get which set and who will make a shelter from what, because we'll need to spend a night in the forest. So the one who wins now takes the best set that is with scotch tape. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Damn, I got a set with a plastic film. Whenever I want something, I don't get it. But in my kit there is such a cool kerosene lamp. But we didn't take matches. Oh yeah, we didn't take any matches. I have a tape measure, I also have a rope, a knife, scissors, and there's one, I don't know what it is, probably a mosquito net. And there is one roll of scotch tape. This is my set. Maybe it's mine, you got it accidentally, give it back to me. I have a smaller and similar set, I have a lot of scotch tape. How many rolls are there? Two, four, six, nine rolls of scotch tape and anti-mosquito net and wallpaper. Yes, wallpaper. Knife, scissors. You got even this. I also have a flashlight. Wow. Cool. I don't know how Sergei will build his tent or shelter, but person that I need for trees so that they are as uniform as possible in a square shape. You see, there are three trees here, and if there were four, then my framework would be ready. Only I would have to torment with a bit with a roof. Guys, look, I found the perfect spot. We've been walking through the woods for 30 minutes, and finally, I think I found the location I need. Good for you. Here, one tree is extra, but it stands alone one line, so it won't interfere. I have already thought about how my house will look like. It will be completely similar to the Soviet tent. There will be cool roofs, such walls. I mean, it will really look like a house. It will be dark and scary at night, so we decided that tents would be next to each other. I have already found a location for myself. Here will be Fika's tent, as he decided, and here will be mine. For these, there are two such large trees, but I'm afraid that my kit won't be enough for this. My work is pretty simple, just wrap tape around the trees. You see how good it was that I had a tape measure in my kit? Now I know for sure that I will make myself a house of 2 and 2 meters, so that I, with my high of 1 and 8, can lie down comfortably here. See, it's much easier to do it from scotch tape. I have already made a third of the tan, but Sergei only tied one rope and did nothing more. I just have a lot of mathematical calculations to do, I want to do everything exactly, I just want my tent to be even and beautiful. It's more difficult to make it, but it should turn out more airtight and beautiful. As you can see, I'm finishing the last corner and the roof of my tent will be ready. This is the most important thing in my tent, because then everything will be done according with that. I'm making a rigger pole, just like the tents used to be set up earlier. You see all sides attached to the tree. I have already started making the door in order to cut here and also make sure that it didn't fall. I need to glue everything on top with tape as well. You think it won't fall? I hope not. I will be making the walls now, they are very easy to do. They don't have to be glued, I just need to attach them with the tape somehow around the entire perimeter and make a door. Well, I'm feeling optimistic, but let's see how it goes. That's it, the door is ready, the walls are ready, now I can make the roof. But how you will make the door? You will give me the plastic film. I have already made my tent or rather framework and now I want to make the door. Before that I want to show you how everything is done here. This is you know that I fixed the edges to the trees. As you can see I made a third middle spacer or I don't know what to call it. I made it on both sides. At the bottom I made these small packs and fixed the bottom with them so that the film doesn't move and is stable. Now we'll cut out the door. I already want to go inside and see how it's like. So I'm getting to my house. This is my den. My tent. Now I'm protected from everything. By the way, can you hear the echo? It's really audible. Outsiders are not allowed in my tent. I really feel comfortable here. Woo!
Look what kind of mosquito net I made. I took the mesh back for fruit, glued it with tape to the film, or rather to the tape. Yeah, it's tape over tape. Now it remains to cut this part from the inside, and that's it. I will have ventilation. It won't be hot like in the greenhouse because of the window, and mosquitoes won't fly in. I will also do it for me now. Whoa. We don't need to work so hard. We don't need to act strong. It's been too long. Now we are starting the presentation of our tent so that you can determine who's better. Let's go! I want to start by saying that it's very spacious here. Initially it seems that Sergei had more space, but in fact mine is more spacious. But a very inconvenient door. Very spacious. This is a minus. But you have no door at all, you just have a hole in the film. And what is this thing? This is a chandelier, a autonomous one. Not bad. Now let's go to the Sergei stand. Come to my cozy apartment in the world. Well, what's cool about it? I feel like I'm in a marquee. There is a lot of space here. Everything is natural, natural materials of manufacture. Natural materials? Are plastic film natural materials? No, but you must admit that my tent is better. Scotch tape is not interesting. By the way, you can stick to the tape. You agree that it's better here. It's very hot here. It's hard to even breathe. It's more comfortable here in most spaces. Spacious? It's cramped here like a hostel. Look, I'm lying totally. Totally? Your legs are almost on the street. You have your head on the wall and you say that you have completely laid down. He's got a head on the wall. No, no, no. No, it's not true. Yeah, just, just got up. It's cramped and hot here. It's just dorm room. There is no other way to say it. Everything is great here. So don't lie. Well, guys, without you, we can determine which tent is better. I think it's mine. But we want to know your opinion. So be sure to write in the comments because you are the real jury for today. I know that you're strong. But life can be furious and things can go wrong You go, you go, we're better off tomorrow But who knows, who knows, if we get joy or sorrow Because get up. What time is it now? Five eighteen. Get up, it's time to get ready. All my bones are ache because of the cones on the ground. What did you want? We are in the nature. I want to sleep. Get up. Tell how it was. Was it cold? How to get out of here? You did it yourself, so you should know. Let's drink water, put away the tents and go home. While we are removing our tents, we already managed to make ourselves up and you are probably still sleeping at this time. Well, write in the comments which of these tent houses you like the most. Also, hit the thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. By the way, I managed to get enough sleep because it was warm in my tent or perhaps it's all because of the weather. So if you like this video, then hit the thumbs up. Leave your comments below. We we'll love you. We know you always watch us. So stay turned. It was Fikas and interesting with you. See you next Sunday. Bye. Bye. One day she said, write me a love song, cause I know you Blah, blah.